arrested an illegal refinery at Umwechem in Echel local government area and river state. State Commandant of the Corps, Basil Ikwebueze, says the anti vandal unit uncovered the site through credible intelligence. The team recovered the 20,000 liters capacity receiver open tank, 25 liters cooking pots, and four inch galvanized pipes. Speaking with newsmen at the illegal refinery site, spokesperson of the command, Olufemi Ayodele, explains that the site was discovered by the anti vandal unit of the command. He promises that the officials of the command will ensure that all illegal refineries are destroyed. Also, the head of the anti vandal, Peter Zibisu, explains how the illegal refineries works. The effect of operating a liberal oil bumping site like this, it has a negative and a debilitating effect on the environment, it causes environmental uh, hazard, it causes pollution, and um, you can imagine if this activity should succeed in this particular environment, you know, it spreads uh, across board, there will be pollution of the air. And so therefore, we are going to make sure that this is uh, totally eradicated. We're going to make sure that this site does not operate. This particular place we are is not far from Ibuguta. It's not far. And there is a pipeline that traverses there. And that pipeline conveys crude. So what these bunkers will do, they will connect a point. As you can see, still, the setting is still ongoing. We are yet to conclude it. We will connect from the pipeline, tap from the pipeline, vandalize it, then feed this one. When they feed this oven, this one here, the boy, this one here, the boy, they use different mechanisms, they can use gas, they can use wood to boil. As they boil, just like the uh, conventional refinery, fractional distillation. So now it will be passing through this point. When they heat, you know, the more you heat, as the temperature is going up, you have different products of uh, petroleum. You have uh, PMS, you have AJ, you have DPK. So it will run through this pipe. But they don't heat it for long, because PMS is very inflammable. So as soon as they heat AGO, they are OK. Meanwhile, yes. the state commandant, Basil Igwebuizi, promises to make the state uncomfortable for illegal oil dealers. The Corps will not relent in this effort to continue to tackle the illegal oil dealers and other vendors in the state so that the state will be very uncomfortable for them to put in and consequently for them to either abandon their illegal trade or to relocate to any other place that they deem favorable to put in. And we always rely on actionable intelligence from the public to aid us in activities because we act on prompt intelligence and it is intelligence that drives our operation. The commandant maintains that the NSCDC has a clear statutory mandate to safeguard critical national assets and infrastructures across the Federation and River State Command will not be deterred by the activities of oil thieves. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.